was an absolute nightmare. Uh, the Sunday before, I messaged Joyce, my coach, and I was like, I'm gonna take today off, I feel a little odd. Uh, I think I was just really hard, like, kind of weak leading in. <clears throat> he was like, yeah, no bother me, you do what you need to do. And I ended up going for a nap midday and I slept for nearly five hours. I was like, oh no. I uh, woke up on the Monday, felt horrendous. I think my whoop score was down to maybe like 10%. And I was like, oh no. Um, yeah, basically he was in bed from like the Sunday right through until Joyce arrived on the Wednesday. I got out, got out of bed, did a 20 minute spin on the bike, ended up back in bed for nearly three hours. Um, tried to move again on Thursday, ended up back in bed. And then Friday, I came out, um, started the first workout, the crossover one, a couple of times, and didn't go very well. I was sick and just everything in between. So uh, yeah, I don't know what I had, like a flu virus -y kind of thing, but um, day one was really, really hard. I kind of, it sunk in halfway through the day that I mightn't be going to semi-finals this year. Um, but thankfully, day one, looked at the leaderboard, I was sitting in 50, 54th, and I was like, right, okay, I'm in with a fighting chance here. If I can do that, feeling horrendous, um, day two can only be better. Um, I, I did lost over four and a half kilos, so energy was low. Um, I got through the workouts, hoping I would be able to repeat the workout five on the Sunday. But by the time I got the Sunday, my body had completely shut down. So uh, we just had the hope, hope that we had done enough. And thankfully, we're in a position now that we're 28 days out from semifinals and feeling healthy again, which is which is awesome. So what does the next few weeks of training look like? Uh, um, yeah, so we're just really pushing like kind of like heavy the heavier side on the weights now Just trying to see like where's the limit? Can we go like every 10 seconds on the heavier bar? Are we pushing the limit? You know at seven seconds obviously like every second counts So we're just trying to find the limit on uh, where the heavy numbers are um, And then in terms of just metcons and stuff uh, my biggest weakness over this past couple of seasons has been being able to go fast um, I'm kind of known for the long, the longer kind of style workouts coming through. So um, all my workouts are 30 seconds and two minute work. So um, definitely working on like that, that kind of like speed par. So that's been the focus. And then obviously just keeping uh, the 20 minute stuff ticking over with like just conditioning and stuff. Uh, so just basically like training, uh, like maybe do some like eating, wouldn't take my advice. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, just like training, eating, like my day to day, like kind of like schedule and um, like what we get up to and then hopefully tag along for some competitions and see what it's like behind the scenes. You're like, I just, you tell me, do the regional starter. <laughs> Thank you.
until 10 Parallel Hand Fan Push Ups and 1 up 10 Ring Muscle Ups. 50 GSDs, buy in and cash out. <laughs> Save the rave. <laughs> Both of those movements is gonna be hard like. It'll be like the hair of the tortoise, you just keep trumping along. Stop what you're making, everybody here knows that you just fake you Nah, I don't wanna hear it anymore, I don't wanna hear it anymore All these fucking thoughts that you're not what I need anymore I'm about to shut the motherfucking door on all you poor ass haters With your heads in the clouds, talking out loud so proud You better shut your goddamn mouth before I do more speak out It's about to end never out. gonna make it You ever see your English man? Uh, he, he, he has an Instagram page dedicated to reviewing Bickies no. Did, you, did you see it? No. Oh, he's so funny, but. Of course, you follow that. Do you want to see him? He's a laugh. Is he into his tea? That's it. So he's always drinking a cup of tea and then he's reviewing biscuits. That's What's his favourite biscuit? Oh, it'd have to be an Iron Fox's classic, wouldn't it? Iron oh, Fox classics are the big. What's your favourite biscuit? Huh? Oh, I do. I like a wee Jammy Joey, or I, lo I do love a wee Fox's biscuit, to be fair. But I don't get them. <laughs> you don't watch Fox Biscuit? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's be quite hard. I'll get you going. PD, wouldn't be as generous with the treats? No. No. PD's like, you're not getting that. I don't get, get that. I don't get the same for sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm only 90 kilos. <laughs> 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 